Welcome back to Kingdom Kids, boys and girls. I'm so glad to have you here with us today. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe. My name is Linda, and we're so excited to have special guests here with us today. Emily and Derek are going to be here to share a wonderful book with us. Come on, let's get started. I can't wait. Our book today is called Spring is Here. And this is going to be such a good book to read, especially at this time of the year, because we're all looking so forward to spring being here. Derek and Emily, we're ready for a good book, and it's called Spring is Here, and it was written by Pamela Jane, and the pictures are by Melissa Sweet. Look at the front of the book. You see some things on the front of the book? Rabbits! Yes, rabbits, and rabbits are some of God's little spring animals. God has those animals born in the spring. Do you see anything colorful over here coming? What do you see, Emily? Flowers. Flowers. So God loves to make those flowers come out in the spring. Let's find out what's going to happen in spring. Cats. Cats. Yes, that's more animals, God. I love to Maggie's farm. At the close of day. Things happen in a special way, inside, outside, far and near. Watch and listen. Spring is here, and it's almost here. Inside the farmhouse, on a hill, Meow. one cat Meow. curls on Meow. the windowsill. There it goes. Emily, would you like to turn the page, and we'll see what's next. Hi. Oh. <gasps> Oh, look at it. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Sit down. Outside, two crickets chirp and sing. They're happy that it's finally spring. Inside, look inside the tree trunk. Look at the hole in the tree trunk. Inside a tree trunk, snug and tight. Three bunnies curl up for the night. Look at the bunnies curled up. Let's count them. One, two, three. Good job, guys. Derek, would you like to be the one to turn this page? We might find some special. Oh. Dog. 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 Is that not exciting to see what's God made for us in the spring? Listen now. Side the gate and far away, all frogs croak at the close of the day. Have you ever heard a bullfrog croak? Maybe this spring, Mommy and Daddy can take you to like a little stream and find some bullfrogs. Inside the barn, five puppies play. Show me five. One hand. Very good. Five puppies play. They roll and tumble in the hay. Roll and tumble. Good. Good job. Good rolling and tumbling. All right. Well, I think we're back to your turn to turn the page. Let's see oh. what's next. Let's see what's next, Eric. Outside piggies. Outside six pigs are having fun. The farmhand left the latch undone. That means the lock on the gate. The farmhand left it unlatched or unlocked. So the piggies can do what if there's no lock? The piggies do. Run out. Run out, exactly. 
Now, look here. We've got a beehive. We've got to be careful. We don't want to get stung inside the beehive. Seven bees make honey from the apple trees. Those bees are busy making their honey. You see them? And see, we can touch these because these are just in our book. We wouldn't want to touch a real bee, would we? We'd get stuck. Hey, uh, Derek, are you up now to turn the page? I believe it's. Oh, look. Look, look. Let's see what this page says. Outside, eight deer browse in the dark. They hunt for twigs and tender bark. Inside the cellar, now the cellar's like the basement. Underground. Nine spiders spin without a sound. Look at the spiders. <laughs> Underground. I'm in the basement. I like that page. Emily, I believe we're back to you. Emily, would you like to be my special helper this time? Oh, look, and somebody's in bed. Outside, ten birdies call. Listen to what the birdies are going to say. Listen to the birdies, Derry. But inside, Maggie's fast asleep. Look at her. She's asleep. Yes, very sweet. On Maggie's farm, at the close of day, things happen. Special. Inside, outside, far and near. Watch and listen. Spring is here. We love spring. Did you like the book? I thought it was a good book, too. Thank you for calling. Did you hear a lot of wonderful things in our book about spring that God gave to us? We're so excited this time of the year to see the new flowers popping out of the ground, the leaves budding on the trees, and then the sounds we hear, all the animals that are born in spring, all the birds that'll be flying around, little babies coming out of their little eggs, the baby birds. So we just have so many wonderful things in springtime to thank God for. We're so thankful for all the things he provides in spring. I hope you enjoyed our story today, boys and girls, and I'll look forward to seeing you next week. Bye-bye.